Well, the high heat, it's been with us and it's going nowhere, at least in the short term. Hi, meteorologist Mike Brookins with your first alert weather forecast. And we started this heat wave. We kicked it off on Sunday. Last Saturday was in the lower 80s. We jumped to 91 on Sunday and we've been at 90 plus since then, peaking yesterday at 94. And we're going to be awfully close today again with 93, 93 also for Friday. Finally, there'll be some changes arriving coming Saturday. So it looks like a six day heat wave with temperatures dropping Saturday thanks to a cold front. Well, there's been some deaths across the country because of the heat wave that's ongoing and other portions of the country as well. And we're talking about some heat safety tips here. Most of these common sense don't want to be your mom here. You don't drink the fluids. You slow down. Of course, you're going to want to seek air conditioning if you can do so. Most important thing, and it's just a little reminder I'd like to put in your head is never to leave your kids or your pets in cars. Uh, you never know what could happen if that car turns off and all of a sudden it gets real hot real quick in there. We'd hate to see something like that and it happens. It happens every year. 82 our high temperature normally. Well, we're going to be above that, probably shy of the record by just a couple of degrees, as we showed you with 93. 97 is our record today. Yesterday's record was 101, so we were nowhere near that, but a little bit easier attained today. The sunrise was at 541, goes down at 840. Now we're under 15 hours of daylight. Yesterday, a trace of rain, but it was very sporadic. Some areas got a lot of rain, over an inch of rain, so uh, it's really depending on where you are now versus the June rainfall, which pretty much everyone got. Now we're getting this very localized thunderstorms and there'll be some thunderstorms popping up today with the heat and humidity of the day. It's day number five of 90 degrees plus last steamy day comes up Friday. That's with that cold front that comes in Saturday. We're expecting scattered showers and thunderstorms. Still a lot of humidity, but this front will cleanse the atmosphere so that by Sunday we could be looking at highs in the 70s with very low humidity. Delightful weather there. The sunshine during the morning and dry conditions will lead to pretty hot conditions here by one o'clock. We'll show you the high temperature map and we're expecting a pop up of isolated showers and thunderstorms. Now we'll find a few more numerous showers and storms up to the north and a little sooner. Going into the evening, still a threat for a shower, <coughs> excuse me, or a thunderstorm, though still widely scattered. No fronts in our vicinity, so we're not going to find, you know, widespread showers and thunderstorms. That comes possibly Saturday. Humid weather for tomorrow morning, some patchy fog that burns off. We get the sunshine and the thunderstorms get going again during the afternoon on Friday. Saturday, that process could be a little different with the cold front coming in. Maybe early in the morning, we're already dealing with some scattered showers and storms and some breaks and then some more for the afternoon. 93, our high temperature for today, nearing the century mark in New York City. Today's high there, 97, 98 in Washington and Richmond. So just about all of the Northeast baking with the exception of Maine, where they're in the 80s. Well, we're in the 80s very quickly during the late morning and Almost at 90 by noon. Look for a high temperature today of 93. Factoring that humidity, the heat index feels closer to the upper 90s this afternoon. Our skies bright in the morning start to turn a little bit more overcast at times, especially mid to late afternoon with those pop up showers and thunderstorms, and some of those could pack a punch. There's a risk for damaging winds and large hail. If there's any warnings, we'll crawl it on the bottom of the screen. You can always go to our CNY Central app and get the latest with Triple Doppler Radar or CNYCentral.com with Interactive Doppler Radar. Still some isolated showers or thunderstorms early on. Then tonight turns quiet again and stays muggy in the 70s. 93, just up the temperature again for tomorrow. Though we'll be in the 80s come Saturday and 70s on Sunday. Nice dry day on Sunday too. It's probably one of the best of the coming week. Have a great day.